Alrighty, this is a new game uh, called The Forest. It uh, just appeared on Steam on Saturday as a, as a kind of a pre-alpha type thing. Uh, it's purported to be a open world horror genre survival type game. So that really sounded intriguing to me, so I thought I would try to take a look and uh, you're welcome to come along for the ride if you'd like. So anyway, go ahead and get started here. And just so you know, like I said, this this is an alpha build, uh, as the sign says, and they're you know expect to see some bugs, kind of like uh, the early DayZ. Uh, actually, what am I saying? Still still in DayZ, uh, but still um, maybe some things in here that seem odd or don't work well, and we're just going to kind of take that with a grain of salt and just kind of get a flavor for the game and just you know see what that's like. So anyway, right now I'm just kind of rambling, killing time until uh, we get done with this little loading screen right here. So, um, so, how you been? <laughs> All right, so here we are. Here we are. So we're in our aircraft, we're in our seat. Uh, looks like a little bit of rough, rough weather maybe ahead. Uh, some uh, pretty empty, and I got a little rug rat on my side, and he appears to be sucking on my elbow. I wonder if he's supposed to be mine. Uh, I don't know. I would assume so. Either that, or he's just a very fresh kid. Whoa! What's going on? Oh, that can't be good. That's a lot of light. Oh, no, we're all gonna die. Oh, gee, just like it lost. Well, at least he's not sucking up my elbow anymore. That's a hell of a way to have to get him off. Oh, and here comes the ground. Oh, put your head between your knees. Kiss your ass goodbye. Here we go. It's gonna be bad. Oh, man. Oh. Alrighty. Well, I assume since uh, it's starting to haze up that we survived that thing. Oh my gosh, who we got here? Well, there's the kid, and he's either wants a new friend, or he's hungry, or he wants a tax deduction. So either way, I think that's a bad thing, and I would guess my job is to try to get that kid back and survive, because one without the other doesn't work. All right, well, there's my hands, grubby as they are, and here we are inside the aircraft, and yeah, it looks like uh, looks like there's not a lot of people around. Poor uh, flight attendant. I believe she's had better days. Pantyhose tore and everything. Oh well. She's got something stuck in her. I wonder. Oh, okay. So I got me an axe. That's a good thing. A little weapon. So I'll tell you what, unless they got something that prevents it, I believe I would like to uh, just hang around this aircraft as my, uh, my base of operations. So anyway, if you look at your lower right of the display, you'll see a little stomach indicator showing that I'm about half full. Uh, on the left is your health, and on the right is your stamina, and you utilize both of those in different ways. So I'm going to go ahead and eat now and see if I can bring that back up. So my stamina is increasing, and you see my health is slowly going back up. So we're just going to go through and see what else we can gather here. Uh, I have discovered that there's not a way to set key bindings yet, and I don't have the... What, what the hell is that? <laughs> How odd. Huh. He didn't poop on my finger but anyway even if he did that may be a good way to catch food later i'll just stick my finger out and let a bird signal appear so anyway we're going to go ahead and uh, try to gather up uh, as much of this stuff as we can it's a really neat inventory system which i'll show you a little more so in a in a bit uh, just gathering up everything eating what i can oh somebody's somebody's had a little worse day than i have so if I set up uh, as a base inside this uh, plane, I'm going to wish there was a way to get rid of these bodies. I think that's going to start stinking out here in the woods. So i got all this stuff. Go back up front because I believe that's the way out. looks like everything else was blocked. I want to show you the inventory system. I thought this was beautiful. So you've got this little blanket laid down, and you've got all the stuff that you currently have in your inventory. In this case, i got my little sodas and some of the little bottles of booze and all and then your lighter, which is going to be a lifesaver later on. The axe I just picked up, obviously. And then this survival guidebook. On the survival guidebook, you click on that, and it brings up a neat little uh, tutorial type thing showing you how to survive in the woods, and it has broken down into different different areas. I can only guess that these others are going to come uh, over time, or maybe it's something that you have to build up skill to do. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, you start the crafting, and, or the, the, the book through here, the little tutorial, and it shows you how to build shelters and what items you're going to need to do that with uh, that you're going to have to gather and, and harvest from the, the surrounding territory and cutting down trees and such. Um, 
building fires and gathering food and all that good stuff. And then, like I say, you just have all sorts of other things you can do, things you can build. Um, and we'll get into some more of that out here in a bit. So Anyway, we got there. So I think uh, right now I'd like to just go ahead and jump down and kind of take stock of our situation. Oh, shit. Did you see that? Oh, I missed the little zoom thing, you know, like, like you had in DayZ. Seems to be a lot of lizards and rabbits running around, I'm guessing. Oh, this place, this is weird. It's weird, man. Yeah. <laughs> this, uh, this game already feels spooky. I haven't, I haven't done anything. I want to see if I can't get my, uh, my weapon back in hand. Makes me feel better anyway. Oh, there's a campsite. Oh, that's awesome. There's that damn bird again. Huh. I would try to hit him, but I think he's cut my fingers off. Well, I'll tell you what. Instead of doing all that, I'm just going to run and check this camp out first. I've, uh, I've actually kind of run through this a little bit. I have yet to uh, get to see a camp like this. That's pretty neat. I've seen a lot of rocks on the ground. Is that a camera? Yeah, i got to fix my key bindings. This is horrendous. A lantern. Oh, that's gonna that's gonna rock, I think. <clears throat> what was that? <laughs> I don't know what just happened. Huh? Did I step on something hot, maybe? So sadly, it's not not it seem to be letting me pick up that that lantern. I would dearly love to have that because right now I got a big lighter. That's uh. Hmm. Ground too. Can I take a tent? Hello? Oh shit, that's not good. That's not good at all. Oh. Oh well. A lot of wildlife. A lot of wildlife. Oh, uh, let me pick up a sleeping bag. Dang it. So there's sleeping bags and there's tents and all sorts of stuff and I can't. I can't steal anything. I get what a stick. Yeah, what a great deal. I can't apparently chop over a lamp either. So it's just some window dressing. All right. Anyway, just kind of dragging along here. So, like I said, crafting is a big part of this game. Um, I'm sure there's other things to be found. I saw some suitcases laying around. I might have to try to relocate again. Right here. Whack our way into those. Pretty much just grab whatever I can come up with. Including a tennis ball. Hello. Hello. Can I play catch? No? Can I wait? Oh, I wish they weren't there. <laughs> I would love to go jump back into my. Skittish. Oh, whoa, he just shinned up a tree. I think I will stay away from that. Yeah, that's a little, uh, <laughs> that's a little concerning. There he is again. Uh, I have my zoom busy. So I don't know. I don't know quite what to do here. Alright, so I guess. And they kind of walk away. Mm -hmm. There looks like Big Boss Man. That's kind of spooky look. Yep, flashlight apparently. Okay, so he does kind of back off a little bit. Well, anyway, I'm going to show you this little deal. A lot of the things you have to do is cutting trees down. This is just an awesome little animation. Just a great way to. Yeah, I think that's much better just walking up and having it. Oh. He doesn't like the looks of me cutting this tree, perhaps. Oh. oh hey, hey, hey! Hey, hey! Whoa, 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 buddy! What the hell was 
that all about? Gee whiz, they, they love trees. I guess, did he think I was attacking him or I just didn't, uh, oh yeah, push that log over here, man. Push that log over here. I can use the help. Oh man, she looks, she looks pretty bad off. All right, well they're gone now. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you this deal here that we're gonna start to build something. Like a, like a wall. <laughs> so I think that'd be a good, a good start here. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that in place. Now if you look to what it takes to build it, I'm gonna have to have five logs. Here and start gathering these logs up from that tree I just whacked down. And you drag them over, just hit the E key, and it sticks them right in that little wireframe or, or ghost image of where they are. And I don't know that they will they do you any good prior to um, prior to being fully built. I don't know. I mean, it looks like there is a space there for it. Oh, oh. Okay. I'm feeling if I come too close, he's going to hit me in the face again. I hope I like that idea. Oh, yeah, he doesn't like me. Hello, hello, get inside. Get inside, damn it. I don't know who you people are. Oh, they're about to kill me, though. Golly, what have I got in here to help? Cracking myself. Just kind of hoping not to start off. Yeah, you. Your buddies aren't coming. Oh, this, uh, back up a tree again. Oh, that would be kind of funny to go cut a tree down when I'm up here. <laughs> kind of meandering around, but, uh, let's see if I can get this thing up pretty quickly here. <coughs> oh, wow. Just dead like that. <laughs> they hate me eating the trees, so, okay, well, we'll have to stop and rethink that one. Oh well, I just wanted to kind of show a first look at the game, and uh, obviously that was a pretty poor <laughs> first execution. Uh, anyway, next time I come back on this, I will uh, concentrate a little more on the crafting. We'll get a fire going, uh, try to skin us a lizard, maybe some of those rabbits, and then kind of explore the area a little bit. So uh, uh, we'll catch you guys next time around, and as always, thanks for the support and all the good comments. <laughs>